Crochet, double crochet. Before you begin, create a slip knot. And then crochet chaining 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then crochet slip stitch at the last chain. Next, crochet chaining 3, 1, 2, 3, and then crochet one double crochet chain one and then three double crochets one two three chain one next three double crochets one two three next crochet chain one and then three double crochets one two three chain one and one double crochet join the round one crochet slip stitch at the third chain first second and third so this created round one and then for round two chain three one two three crochet double crochet in the next stitch in the chaining one space crochet two double crochets one two and then chain one and then two double crochets in the same space one two next crochet three double crochets crochet one double crochet in each stitch one two three and then the chaining one space crochet two double crochets 
one, two, and then chain one. Crochet two double crochets in the same space. One, two, and then this one. One double crochet in each stitch. One, two, three. The chaining one crochet two double crochets. One, two, and then chain one. Two double crochets. One. Two. In the next stitch, crochet double crochet in each stitch. One. Two. Three. Next chaining space. Two double crochets. One. Two and then chain one, two double crochet in the same chaining one space, one, two, and the last stitch crochet one double crochet. Enjoy the round first, second, and third. This created round two, round three. So remember, chaining three. One, two, three, and then one double crochet in each stitch. One, two, and three. So this one, chaining one, we will crochet two double crochets. One, two. So we add two double crochets in one space and then chain one and two double crochet in the same space one two so keep repeating this process all the way around until the end and I will be right back now I am at the end of row three so this one in the corner two double crochets and chain one in the middle and one double crochet in each stitch two double crochets in the chaining one space and chaining one double crochet in each stitch two double crochets and chaining one and two double crochets so for row three, join the round for second and third crochet slip stitch. There you go. And then crochet the next round and I will be right back. Now I have finished with row four. So this square in the corner, we crochet two double crochets, chaining one and two double crochets. So now I am at row four and I will continue crochet round 5 and round 6 so I will be right back on that round now I have finished with 6 rounds so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 for round 7 crochet chain 3 1, 2, 3 and then crochet 1 double crochet in each stitch around so Crochet one double crochet one two keep continuing until the corner now I am at the corner and the chaining one space we crochet one double crochet and then crochet double crochet in each stitch one and two so the chaining one space crochet one double crochet keep continuing all the way around until the end and 
I will be right back. Now I have finished with round seven, and then I will crochet round eight. So for round eight, crochet chain one, and then crochet one single crochet in each stitch. One, two, three. So keep continuing. Crochet single crochet in each stitch all the way around until the end. And I will be right back. Now I have finished with round eight. Crochet single crochet in each stitch around. So to join round eight, crochet slip stitch. Then round nine, round ten, round eleven, round twelve. Keep repeating from round seven and round eight. Keep continuing, and I will be right back when we have finished. Now I have finished with round nine, ten, eleven, twelve. For round thirteen, crochet chaining three, one, two, three, and then crochet one double crochet. Next, crochet chaining two, one, two. And then skip two stitches and crochet in the next stitch. One, two, three, four, and then chain two. One, two. So keep repeating crochet. From this process, skip two stitches and crochet in the next stitch. Next, we will crochet four double crochets. So keep continuing, and I will be right back. Crochet, chain one, and then crochet one single crochet in the. Chain stitch one and two. Next, crochet two single crochets in the chaining two space. One, two, and then in the next space, crochet one single crochet in each stitch. One, two, three. Four. So keep repeating the process. Single crochet in each stitch of double crochet, and then two single crochet in the chaining two space. Single crochet in each stitch. So keep repeating like this all the way around until the end. Two single crochet and then join the round. And the next rounds keep repeating from this round and this round. Keep continuing, and I will be right back. Now I have finished. So next, we are going to crochet the handles. So this I already created one handle. So from this one, one, two, three, and from the corner. This, so from this, the middle, this through this, one, two, three. Start from here. And then chain one. One single crochet in the same stitch. Grab the yarn, and then we will crochet through the yarn. One, two, three, four, five, six. So keep repeating until this one. 
and I will be right back. So for row one, I have 20 single crochets, and then we will crochet the row two. So turn your work. To start row two, crochet chain one and one single crochet in each stitch until the end and I will leave two stitches left. Now I have finished and I have 18 single crochets and I leave two stitches. I will crochet decrease, single crochet decrease, insert and then insert three loops on your crochet hook and then yarn over pull through so this created two single crochet decrease and then for row three turn your work so row three chain one and one single crochet in the next stitch keep continuing crochet single crochet in each stitch and leave two stitches for decrease so for row three i have 17 single crochets and then crochet two single crochet decrease insert one insert two and then decrease for the next next row keep repeating from this process single crochet in each stitch and decrease at the end of the row until you have three single crochets so keep continuing and I will be right back now I am at the end of the row 18 I have three stitches one two and three and then we will crochet row 19 so for row 19, turn your work, we will crochet chain 1 and then crochet single crochet in each stitch and have 3 single crochet 1, 2, 3. So we will keep repeating this process until row 36. Keep continuing and I will be right back. Now I am at the end of the row 36 and then I will crochet row 37 so turn your work chain 1 and then we will crochet increase at the first stitch 1 2 and then crochet 2 single crochet in the next 2 stitches 1 2 and then row 38 turn your work chain 1 for row 38 also crochet the same process we will increase at the first stitch and then the rest we will crochet single crochet 1 2 3 so keep repeating this process until row 43 keep continuing and I will be right back now I am at the end of the row 43 and then the next row, the row 44, turn your work, crochet chain 1. So for this row, we will crochet 10 single crochets. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 7, 8, 9, 10. Next, for row 45, we will crochet decrease. So turn your work, chain 1, and then decrease at the first stitch. 1 and 2, decrease, and then crochet 8 single crochets. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 
8. And then we will keep repeating this process, decrease at the first two stitches. Until the end, you will have one stitch. So keep repeating this process until row 54. Keep continuing and I will be right back. Now I have finished with the row 54 and then chain 1, cut the yarn and pull through. So this finish with the strap. Creating. Before you begin, create a slip knot. And then crochet chaining four. One, two, three, four. And then join crochet slip stitch with the last chain and then crochet chain 3 1 2 3 we are going to crochet double crochets so yarn over insert double crochet for round 1 we will crochet 11 double crochet, one already. Two. Three. So, crochet 11 double crochet. And I will be right back. Now I have 11 double crochets and then I will join the route 1. Crochet slip stitch. 1, 2, 3. Crochet slip stitch. So this created round 1 and then we will simply cut the yarn. We are going to change to white yarn. White yarn. Pull through. Next, we are going to crochet round 2. So, crochet chaining 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then, crochet single crochet at the second chain from your hook. Single crochet. And then, crochet 3 half double crochets. 1, Two, three, and then slip stitch at the next stitch. So first double crochet from round one. Crochet slip stitch. So we have one already. We will crochet this process for 12 times total so this create one time and i will show you one more time so remember crochet chain five one two three four five and then crochet single crochet at the second chain from your hook single crochet and then crochet three half double crochets One, two, three, and then crochet slip stitch at the next stitch. 
insert the hook yarn over and then pull through. So this creates two times and then continue crochet all the way around for 12 times. And I will be right back. Now I have finished with 12 times total. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then crochet chain 1. Simply cut the yarn. And then pull through. At the back, weave in all ends with yarn needle. Do three of this. The wrong side and this one the right side. Congratulations! Now you have finished with your cute carry bag. Yay! Thank you for watching and be sure to check out the crochet channel for lots of exciting easy and best of all free crochet tutorial patterns which you can use to create your own crochet pieces if you enjoyed this tutorial please thumbs up share and subscribe be kind to someone today and keep smiling until the next video